Hello again, this is Justin Amato with NakedTrader.com. I've noticed we have a large following of your dollar spreaders and your dollar traders, so I figured I'd bring you another video back, going back to uh, correlation and how we use the your dollar outright daily signals to trade or utilize through the spreads. Um, we currently don't have spread signals, but uh, given the demand in the near future, we might uh, decide to bring that functionality to our end users. So. Uh, on the left, I'll get into these signals. On the left here, we have a euro dollar outright chart, March 2011. That's the fourth contract on the board currently. We've gone back a few months to this signal. This is uh, d about December 1st, 2009. And on the right, we have a March, March, that's the 12 month euro dollar contract. Um, March 1, front March versus red March. March 1 versus March 2. Um, so basically, uh, on the left here, this signal would have posted or will post now that we're live, uh, now that the site is live, the site is live, uh, will post the daily signal box on your signal page. Uh, for this example, the close was 98.55 even. The um, the trader receiving the signal, if he's an outright scalper. I'm um, looking to stay in this trade for no longer than four days or into the signal, however he's utilizing it, would place a stop uh, above or negate uh, or withdraw from this, signals, uh, uh, this signal and utilizing it in any way he, he or she would like. When the trade uh, breached the 98.65 highs, maybe 67 half, uh, a little bit more breathing room. So, you know, it's about a 12, 10 to 12 tick stop to the upside. That's quite a, quite a ways uh, to hold an outright trade. Now, in order for... For when I was trading these back in the day, I, in order to sleep better, I would have to put on a spread. Um, it's it's a safe way to go. Um, it, you know, if you're unsure of the uh, of the possible market direction, you always have an out. You you have chances to scratch through a through a sp through a spread, um, and it's just it's it's just safer. So, um, if we look at this sell signal here, this day correlates with this black bar down here on the bottom of the March March calendar spread. So what you have is a outright that had, you know, maybe seven tick range move here and then you had an upside range of about a tick and a half in the in the uh in the uh, calendar spread. So not much there, but if you enter if you say, you know what, I don't want to be short the outright here. Um I think that's just a little bit too much risk. Let's let's put on the spread, maybe a six month or a nine month spread um, with this March contract, uh, rather than rather than the twelve month. But for this purpose uh, today, we're using the the March March. So you come back to the chart. It, you're you're long. You decide to buy sixteen and a halves and seventeens in the spread. Um, that's one hundred and sixteen half, one hundred and seventeen. Uh, is the price the full price so within uh, you know uh, probably the next morning you saw a slight lift uh, this by the second day you have a four tick winner so while while the outright here did drop you know pretty pretty nicely on the back of the sell signal um, but you you wouldn't have known that I mean obviously we're, we're talking in hindsight here I mean if none of this had 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 really occurred you know, you didn't know that a 30 point plus move to the downside was going to transpire. The low here is uh, about 24 and a half and, and the high is 62 and a half. So from 55 to, you know, roughly 25, that's that's 20, that's all, you know, about a 30 tick move. So while that's great, um, you're, you're just, there's just more exposure uh, and more risk that you're going to take by being naked short, the outright, um, versus taking a look at some spreads and possibly going long a spread. Um, the reason I correlate these is that many times the spreads, the euro dollar spreads and the outrights have this distinct correlation where when the outrights decide to move lower, the spreads decide to move higher. This isn't always the case. Um, and if you're a trader that can spot this and notice that we are in a pattern where it is going to happen, then by all means, look for your signals, take advantage of the trade, and... Um, and I and and utilize them in any way, shape, or form that can be profitable for you. So um, we urge you to read through the material on the power signals um, section of the site. Uh, watch all our audio tutorials. Most of them are rather short. And um, you know, if you have any questions, always feel free to to email us at tech at nakedtrader.com or admin at nakedtrader.com, and we'll be happy to get back to you as soon as we can. 
I uh, thank you once again for taking a quick listen to uh, correlating our euro dollar outright uh, sell signal here to uh, trading the euro dollar spreads. Uh, this is the March March calendar spread, front March, red March. Uh, thanks again and have a good day.